Since Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. To replace a tub suspension rod cap in your Frigidaire Laundry Center, you will need a putty knife, a Phillips head screwdriver, and a 2x4 wood support. Before you begin the procedure, unplug the power cord and shut off the incoming water supply. Have an assistant help you to move the appliance away from the wall or out of the closet. Detach the venting from the dryer. Remove the hot and cold water supply lines from the inlet valve. Be prepared for some water to spill. Remove the end of the drain hose from the standpipe or laundry tub. Using the putty knife, release the two retaining clips securing the washer's main top. Lift up the top and disconnect the lid lock assembly wire connector. You can now fully remove the main top. Have an assistant help you to lift and support the front of the appliance. Use the Phillips head screwdriver to unthread the two screws securing the washer's front panel to the base. With the screws unthreaded, remove the support, then push the panel down to fully remove. Detach the appropriate suspension rod spring from the tub cover. Now carefully tip the appliance back so it rests on its rear panel. Place the 2x4 piece of wood under the tub to support it. Move the tub towards the top of the cabinet to provide enough slack to remove the suspension rod support cap. Be careful not to damage the out-of-balance lever. Now shift the rod up, then push down on the cap to detach. Rotate and twist the old cap to fully remove. To prepare the new suspension rod cap for installation, Apply some grease to the underside of the cap. Now slide the cap over the end of the rod. Rotate the cap to align the end of the rod with the long slot, and you can snap the cap into place. Now move the out-of-balance lever out of the way and shift the tub back down toward the base. Remove the wood support from underneath the tub. Return the laundry center to its upright position. Attach the suspension rod spring to the tub cover mounting post. Reinstall the front panel by aligning the tabs on the panel with the slots in the frame. Then lift the panel up until the top edge aligns with the top of the frame. Support the front of the appliance. Then replace the two lower screws to secure the panel. Remove the support. Reinstall the washer's main top by first reconnecting the lid lock wire connector. Secure the wire in the retaining clip. Now slide the rear of the main top under the rear retaining clips, then realign the main top and push down to snap it into position. Reinsert the drain hose into the standpipe or hook it onto the edge of the tub. 
reattach the hot and cold water supply lines to the inlet valve ports. Reattach the venting and move the appliance back against the wall or into the closet. Turn the water supply back on. Plug the power cord back in and your laundry center should be ready for use.